With the DX18, you won't need to clutter your model with a complicated network of little boxes in order to balance servos. The DX18's Servo Setup menu allows you to balance multiple servos on a single control surface using a 7-point curve mix. This balance function is available for all 18 channels and is great for balancing helicopter swashplate servos too. As with all DX18's functions, the intuitive simple scroll programming interface makes servo balancing simple. To show you how simple, veteran aerobatic pilot AC Glenn will walk us through the steps for balancing servos on a giant scale 3D model. What we'll do here is we'll turn the transmitter on, go into our aircraft type menu, click on aircraft type, we'll go down the wing, click on normal, we're going to go over to four ailerons. So we have that selected, we'll go back up to list, click list, we'll go back up to main, we'll click on main, then once we'll do that we'll go into our servo setup menu. From there we'll click on travel, we'll scroll over to balance, and as you see it has throttle selected as a, a the first one is always going to be selected. Then we'll go take throttle and go to right aileron one. What we'll do now is go over to the airplane and get it turned on and get the servo set up in the balance feature. The airplane is set up with a current meter plugged into one servo and then plugged into the receiver so we can read the current off of that servo. So now that we're in the balance feature, what we'll do is go to the center point for right aileron one and we're actually going to increase this. If you notice, the sound is going to start going away for one and the current, the amps on the current meter is also going down. Now we're at zero, and if you notice the servos are very quiet now. And now they're balanced. So now that we've balanced the first aileron servo, it's actually now in balance with the second one. So with that being said, now they're synced together, so at center and at full stick and mid stick, they'll move together. And if you, if for some reason they get off, what you can do is go to the next point on the balance function screen, and if you move the servo to that point, then you can balance them together again if they get out of balance. To learn more about the Spectrum DX18 and to find a retailer near you, visit SpectrumRC.com.